Elizabeth Hendrickson is here, who I've loved so many for so many years as Chloe. I think it's so much fun, that character, but she's been through a lot. She has been through a lot. Which mental breakdown of hers is ours to do? Um, right. I don't know. I think one of the really good ones was when she left and stole Billy's sperm. The Billy's sperm thing was a highlight. That, yes. was, that was a good one. And also um, taking baby Connor and taking him to Paris and taking um, but not, Chelsea's. But not throwing dart, the dart gun at... I mean, that was kind of expected. <laughs> I mean, again, it deserved it. Wasn't she a fashionista at first? Yes, yes. Do you wish she would be more of that? Yes, I mean, you know, we were kind of. We were, uh, I love fashion. I'm wearing Florida Mall. Which I think is one of the. Which is a super cool line. Um, I won't make you twirl like the Oscars. <laughs> Thanks. Um, but, uh, and we were headed that way with Sally and and Chelsea yes. and Chloe. Yes. So I still have faith that it might come back around. We keep on saying, Josh, 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 bring it back, bring it back. Now we're interior designers, which yes. <laughs> also, I happen to also love interiors. So I appreciate both. But, um, but geez, I love a good dress. You do love a good dress. I, I know do. you do. I do. Now, what's happening with your child at home? <gasps> growing, growing, growing. See, I, I check out her Instagram and follow. So sweet. Josephine is turning three in a week. It's crazy. I had her the week, two weeks after the pandemic. Everything shut down. And, and you had a baby. And I had a baby. Well, that was a good time to do it, right? It was or, a good time to do it. Yeah, yeah it really was, because we got a lot of time at home with her. It yeah. was really, really good. Did she great. ever see the TV screen and go, Mama? She does not know that I'm on TV. What do you think she'll do once she finds out? I think she's going to, I think it's going to blow her mind. I think she's going to have what? a lot, she's going to talk a lot about it. She's got a lot of questions. She's going to, yeah, she's already asked me, like, Mom, where are you going? Your makeup, Mom, you look so pretty. So I think once she figures, and when I tell her that she was in my belly, while when, you were on the show, I can't wait for that. Pregnancy stories yeah, of, of the and show star. her, like, you were in Mom's belly. And show her one day of when I was pregnant, and I could say, you were in my belly in that. What has YNR given you for your life? Is it not only a job, but what has it enriched your life? The people you've gotten to know, um, the role, or has it been angsty? No, I mean... Because every job has got its ups and downs, I know 100%, that. 100%, but the thing is, is that my childhood dream was to be an actress. So YNR, and, and I had, there were people in my family that were skeptical. And the fact that I've been living my dream for, I've been on the show for 14 years, I've been in soaps for 20, that I was able to, that I'm able to say, I did it. And so it means everything to me. Amazing. Yeah. And in the whole time that you've been on the show, who do you feel like you can go to a dressing room with and hang out and... Missy and, Clary again. It's got to be Missy Clary. It's my girl. Yeah. From all my children to here, or you're on. You know, times. we kind of crossed paths at all my children. Yeah. 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 But we knew of each other, and we had, you know, we had friends in common. But uh, no, she's my, she's like my ride or die. So yeah. So good to see you. It's so good to see you. I too. know. Mwah.